Good day, Lords and ladies, and welcome back to Battle Brothers Me Corner tonight. Last time we went left off, we had just taken contract to do some more patrolling. And let's get on, but shall we? We'll be fighting, gotta jump these guys in this forest here. A few raiders, a few marksmen, some poachers. Not too bad. There's ten of them. Ah, we just got to charge. Right. Let's get up to it, shall we? Probably getting rid of the trees will be a useful idea. Kill him off. There's the marksman. Poacher, poacher. Ugh, there's actually some more of them floating about. Reload. Oh wait, he hasn't got a shield. Oh, I knew I'd forgotten something. Kill him. Missed. That's a shame. Right, let's put him here to cover him. He can jump up here to cover the bannerman. He. Oh, there's a tree there, I'd forgotten about that. He can jump up here to cover him. Another tree. He can go here. Yeah, there's two more people. Right, let's go. Yeah, there they are. Oh, I was hoping he wasn't going to do that. Uh. I'd wondered where their marks had run off to. Push him back there. I keep on forgetting there's a tree in the way. Is there a tree? There isn't a tree, why can't I stand there then? this turn. Indeed. This is why I hate fighting in woodlands. Yep, it's going to be one of those days. First mistake so far, didn't put a shield on someone. Cut him open. Right, let's get to work on him.
pierced his hand and he screams. Put an arrow into that man's stomach. Jump there. I hate fighting in terrain. Missed. Going down here. He's fleeing. He's blocking. Kill him outright. Hoping to kill him. Annoying fellow. He can't get in because of the trees. I don't understand this. There's actually a hexagon there. Is it just because the trees in the way? I mean, I should be able to stand there, honestly. Can't release the dog because there's nowhere to do it. <sighs> Seriously, we still can't hit that guy. Kill him. Kill him or Ross up here and deal with this bloke. Give him a cut artery. We made him bleed and gave him a cut artery and now he's fleeing. He can't do anything. He can't do anything. He can't do anything. He's going to run down here. I'm going to put him here to back him up. A bit of nasty damage. Don't like that. So we're going to move here. He's going to go for that that archer. And we've got to put an arrow through his windpipe. Bring him down here to support. Missed. He can get in here. We'll bring him up. Yeah, archery in, in forest is a really bad idea. Decapitate him. Ripped his ear clean off. He's got a scarper. 
Okay, I thought he was with Scarpa. Braver fool than I thought. He gets done in by the pike. He's broken, he's got to flee next turn. Kill to him. He can't get there, he can't get there. He can get up here and engage this guy. Cut his stomach wide open. He can't do anything, he can't do anything. Run them down. Come on, let's get this done. Headshot. Headshot. Kisses. And here I thought it was going to be easy. Pikeman. Finish him off. A little bit of damage. I mean, I'm not happy with some of the damage, but. Got a bit of stuff. Another male coif. So that's 10 heads. Now, return within 6 days, our contract is to basically finish there. Well, haven't we finished that contract yet? You notice recruiters from a nearby house who are foot pulling young freshmen out of their homes. Conscription isn't an un un ordinary, but typically you still need the fellas to farm the field. If the highborn are leaving back to the woman folk, it means something else is in great, is in great importance, and something else is undoubtedly a brewing war. The Sons of Kunos prepare for itself for the worst world, the worst of anyone else. A war between rich arseholes is a great time to sell sword. Yeah, okay. So, day 69, and it looks like the civil war is about to kick off. Things are about to get interesting. As is the customer, you some of the men have explained the com company next that brothers, the sons of Kuna must show the world we are fools of hotter fire than the other mercenary bands. As our reputation grows, so will our the influence of influx of crowns to our coffers. Let's for forge a path to greatness. You can barely carry any more equipment or spoil to war. Let us save up 750 crowns to buy us a cart to relieve our backs. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Beast orcs in battle and burn down some of their camps would make people recognise a company's ability and we'll do that. Sorry. Besting orcs in battle and burning down some camps would make people recognise the company's ability on the battlefield. Let's do so. Only the most daring take goblins in large numbers. We shall burn some of their few fetid camps. Uh, save 750 crowns for a cart. That could be done. Let's try that. You've reached Durdberg. Vladimir the followers suggest that the company should pick up some supplies. Yeah, let's do that. They've got orc problems. Let's get rid of all this stuff. That reminds me. You need to get a proper shield again. Switch some of the injured people out for a second, just so they can catch their breath and we can get some people in here to heal up. Radio. Ah, that's slightly cheaper for supply tools. Patrol the road to Grands first. I'm pretty sure that's where we had the contract to. We could run down here and see if we can get take care of whatever's in here, or run over to this graveyard. 
Pope's Last Rest. There's a whole host of stuff we haven't done down here, and they probably all give us heads for it. You can't make out what's in the facing. Attack at your own peril and prepare to retreat if needs be. Okay. Ooh, lots and lots of ghasts. It's just all ghasts. Yeah, it's just all ghasts. Okay. This is going to be interesting. Oh, right, gentlemen. Missed. Let's just blind fire and hopefully one will hit. You get about a 5% chance to hit them. Don't have some of the greatest weapons for this, unfortunately. Luckily, I do have my standard bear up. So when they get close and start shrieking, it's going to be a pain. Like that. Killed that one. Right, first off. Let's kill these guys. I hate fighting these things. You can only ever hit them 5% chance. He's rallied. Get here. Bannerman will go here. Spearman will go here. Or Pikeman will go here. They've got to start shrieking all over the place. Oh god. No! Weissman's... Oh, no! No, 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 no! Uh, Weissman! Lost Wiseman.
Wiseman. Oh, at least they got his gear, but even so, that's a really nasty loss. Oh, day 70. Had him 70 days. Really gotta hurt. <sighs> Curses. I've forgotten how nasty they were in big groups. guys. Twenty-five kills. Uh, I've forgotten what it was like fighting against those things. Fallen hero, many under wide ganger and a necromancer. Mm. With the Civil War kicking off, I don't want to risk it. I know people are going to go, oh, it'll be fine. I'm just, I don't know, I'm just a bit disheartened by losing Wiseman. That was my own fault. I'd forgotten that in big numbers they can be like that. I also had forgot. I'd also forgotten they were predominantly... Oh, what was I going to say? They were predominantly... Um, had the ability to do that the whole sort of death touch thing, I'd forgotten they could do that. Right, let's go and kill these. I need to get some more heads. None of these are rabid. It's nice. I must admit, I'd like to actually see them, see what they're going to do with the werewolf faction, with the beast faction. Rip the tear clean off and screams. They missed. Put an arrow to its face and it screams. Cut an artery. Cut another artery. Which way are they going to go? Let's join in. Here. I thought they were the flank for a second. That was what I was worried about. They're all suffering from low morale now, so that's good. And the war is coming. Pierce that on the leg and it screams. Move him up here to support this chap here. Rip it side wide open. Pierce its front paw. Pierce it in the gut with a crossbow bow and it wants to now start fleeing. Uh, seriously. Pierce its paw again. Damage tankle, break its leg. So they're all basically now fleeing. Well, except for that one, of course. Kill that one. Jump in here, headshot. Run them down. These things are really tough. But 
I'd like to see like werewolves to actually see like full blown werewolves, that would be awesome. I'd love the sight they have werewolves running about on the battlefield. If they really that's one of the things I wish they'd do with the beast factions, like give them like like hamphrobes and like all kinds of like wild like wilderness creatures. Right, we've got 25 out of 25 who won't get any more so we can run back to town and get paid. I'm still really sad about Wiseman. It better not be following me. I know I'm behind on money. Step in. You return the Count Quiet von Einstein in his met curiosity. He's counting crowns, but before giving you any, he asks you how many heads you collect in your journey. You report after reporting 25 kills, he purses lips and nods. Good enough. The man spills some crowns into a sack, so the hands over. Back in business. That's ground first. As you enter ground first, to find a group of laymen standing around a wooden platform. Thinking there's a hanging to be seen, you quickly push through the crowd. What you find instead is a queerly dressed man barking out news to the town folk. Harken, 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 a determined a, de a determination has been made between the noble house of Instein and Elstert. Elstert, they have come to a conclusion all sides can only agree upon. They hate one another. Nervous whispers rank rankle the crowd as the volume builds. The whispers crescendo into a host. The minstrel continues. That's right, my fair, my fair, fair folk, war is upon us, and yes, this that fickle beast which lies dormant in all men, a sad affair, a righteous affair, an honourable one. An old man standing in front of you grumbles and spits, he leaves, shaking his head and murmuring to himself, the minstrel presses on, his excitement no match, not matching the terrified faces before him. Let's not the one dwindle and tell I am being instructed to speak thrustily. Men, take up arms where you can, plough your fields while you can't. Women... Women raise your sons right, least they raise a sword all wrong. Finally, the minstrel takes a great big breath. And amongst those who wish to earn a good crown or two, the noble houses are looking for the fine surfaces of any man who can swing a sword. Those among you of lesser honour, you bridal loose thing, bridal stealers, leech sellers, smel small smell smocks, near the wells, vice abused, vice abused and run amok, brigands, bandits, thieves, grad thieving graduates, you sickly and poisoned monsters. The cursed and rabid, the cured and vapid, sell swords and poets, selling words. This, my friends and men, is your time. Go out there, fight for nobles, and earn yourself a new life. A saying that a war isn't is not last forever, so best do it quick. It looks as though the Sons Kurnos future is quite bright on account of the loads of gold you're about to earn. War is upon us. Okay, so the civil war has begun. So are they actually fighting yet? So here we are, this is the end event. Alright, we need to sell some stuff. So that... Sell the pelts. Ooh, we're getting a good price for the pelts all of a sudden. Probably because it's a war zone. almost get a total if we could sell a bit more stuff. So the cheap crossbows don't need them. So some of the quivers of arrows. We're okay for food. What's this contract? A message of greets you, he's named himself someone forgettable. His name himself as his name's himself as someone forgettable because you instantly forget his name. However, his information is quite important. A local album has requested your audience to talk business. Nope. Green skins. He's asking about green skins. It isn't worth it. Anybody here worth recruiting? For a decent price. Melissa. Bastard. Ooh, a bastard. He might be useful, actually. I want to get the cart first, and I'll hire someone new. Hawking leveled up. Pike.
let's see, what do I want to give him? Underdog is nice, footwork is also nice. But brawny would be really useful because I mean, I could give him slightly heavier armour. Backstab is really nice. I'll take on the dog because we'll probably get jumped in the large battle soon enough. And there we have it. We unfortunately lost Wiseman. I'm really sad about that. Thrown to death by Geist. I'm not happy about that. Uh, but it's just how it goes. So now the Civil War is here. I, to be honest, I don't know how this is going to work. I've never done the Civil War event before. I've never done any of the End Crisis before. I've always, I never got it this far. So this is going to be a new territory for me as well as you. I've been Cornish Knight. If you have liked, please press the like button. If you wish to subscribe, please press the subscribe button. You can follow me on Twitter or look me up on Steam. I shall see you tomorrow. I've been Cornish Knight. Goodbye.